Hey everybody, time for another three minute office meeting. Today is December 1st and I gotta tell you, here at the Green Valley office, I'm so excited because it is a hub of activity. I guarantee you walking to a lot of the other real estate companies around town, it's a ghost town because everybody's sleeping, they're cyber mundering, still sleeping off the tryptophan from the turkey and they're deciding, ah, maybe I'll just take the rest of the month off. What I can tell you is I love December because while everybody else sleeps, the savvy agent can make a bunch of money. Houses never show better than they do in December when they're all done up for the holidays, and it's really just a great, great time to go show houses. So set yourself up for success. If you're watching this from home and you're sitting there in your jammies and your slippers watching Maury Povich, get up and go to work because I'm telling you, a little bit of effort now can pay off spades in quarter one next year. Now, a lot of people have been asking me about our holiday party, which is coming up on December the 13th. That's not this coming up Saturday, but the following Saturday, it's at 1923 Burlesque and Bourbon at Mandalay Bay. It is a 1920s Prohibition theme burlesque club. It's going to be awesome. The party is Simply Vegas Empire. It is Prohibition themed. For those of you who don't know what that means, watch Boardwalk Empire. Dress period appropriate. It's going to be awesome. Gangsters, it's going to be great. We have some unbelievable live entertainment planned. We've got some great food, great drinks. It's from 7 to 10 o'clock. After the party is over at 10 o'clock, no, they're not going to kick us out. We'll just stay there as long as we want. I could just only reserve the room for a certain amount of time. But definitely they want us to stay. So it's at Mandalay Bay. You can get rooms there. Uh, there's a lot of other opportunity for things to do afterwards, too. There's foundation room. Uh, there's mix. There's light. So I'm sure it's going to be a great night. I hope to see all of you there. I need you to RSVP by the end of this week because we have to have a final headcount. How do you do that? Go into the calendar and back agent. Go into your back agent. Go to the calendar on the right-hand side from the main page. Click on the 13th and you'll see the event and RSVP right there within the event so we can get a final headcount. I need to know who's coming because we have to make some final preparations for some special things that we're planning. So make sure you do that by December the 5th. We hope to see all of you guys there. The last little thing I want to talk about real quick because I've had a lot of questions about it are what do you do when your clients call? When they see these properties that are priced $50,000 under market, and we all know there are people trying to flip those HOA leads. Here's the hard reality. Stay away from them because this is why. No title insurance company is going to issue title insurance on those properties. Now, my guesstimation is Bank of America, Chase, and Wells Fargo aren't just going to roll over and take a billion dollar hit here in Las Vegas. They're going to challenge that law all the way up to the Supreme Court of the United States. Whether it stands, I have no idea, but it's probably going to take about three years to get through the entire legal system to get to a point where they're going to make a decision as to whether it's going to stand or not. So for me, if I'm an investor, if I want to take a chance on one of these properties, the maximum I'm willing to pay for any one of those properties to basically buy that first position right is going to be three years times whatever the monthly rent is. Because then at least at the bare minimum, I'm going to break even on my rent, that even if the property reverts back to the original owner and or the original lender, at least I'm not going to lose a bunch of money. But if you start paying $100,000 more than that, that's a lot of risk for something that could blow up in your face. Now, do I think it's going to stand? Do I think it's not going to stand? Honestly, I don't know. Uh, again, that's a lot of money with the big banks and a lot of leverage to not somehow work politically to get that thing overturned. So keep that in mind. If your clients ask, that's the correct answer. You're not really buying a house free and clear. You're buying a clouded title, and it's just not worth it. So stay away from it because I guarantee if your client loses $100,000, the first place they're going to come shopping to get it back is going to be you. Well, that's all I got for this week. Again, RSVP for the Christmas party. Do it today. Do it right now. And hopefully we'll see all you guys in two weeks. And let's have a great week and go sell some real estate.